What's up AUDL fans, Daniel Cohen here with this week's Cohen's Cut. Today we're going to be looking at the San Diego Growlers red zone set, and how they implement a vertical stack offense to attack the break side. The Growlers rely on this vertical stack because of the way it creates space, particularly break side space. And since they've got a bunch of throwers that can consistently break their marks, this gives them an edge over most defenses. So we see the sequence begin with Hunter Corbett and Tim Okita in the backfield. Now in the red zone, San Diego loves to initiate their vertical stacks from the front, because this cutter has the most options of space to attack compared to the other positions in the stack. They can cut in, or deep, or even straight horizontally, either to the force side or break side. So from the front of the stack, Paul Lally begins by cutting in towards the force side to center the disc. Now Corbett and Okita both clear out of the backfield after this initial throw, which is super key because it takes their defenders out of the play and clears space for the next cut to come from the front. Now it's Goose Helton's turn as the active cutter next, and remember the Growlers are always trying to take advantage of open breakside space. So Goose times his cut really well here. Right after Corbett and his defender run by on the four side, Goose fakes a cut to that vacated space, then right as Okita is bringing his defender out of the breakside space, Goose cuts back hard to get that inside break from Lally. By attacking the breakside, it puts the defenders on the wrong side of the downfield cutters, which gives the offense openings for continuation cuts. Here, the back of the stack defender actually commits hard to stopping the breakside continuation, so it forces the cutter in the back of the stack to move towards the crossfield space. Now running away from the defender, plus a hard fake from Goose, pulls that defender out of the space that the Growlers want to attack. Now watch Jesse Cohen, whose defender had been trailing him since the throw to Helton. He times a perfect follow-up cut to the break side once that defender is cleared out of the space. Goose hits him with a backhand break, and the Growlers convert for the game-winning goal over Dallas. Thanks for watching, and be sure to join me next time for another Cohen's Cut.